This building is turning heads along I-4 in Eatonville, and it's still under construction. Yeah, and when we heard that this new building has a rooftop conference center and a floating basketball court, we had to check it out. So, first of all, explain this building right here along I-4. What's this going to be? It's actually a Tier 4 data center. There's currently only five Tier 4 data centers in the whole United States right now. This is going to be the sixth public Tier 4 data center. It's basically where the cloud lives, an ecosystem of these facilities all around the world is what power, what we consume right now as the modern day cloud. Yes, this is the cloud. When people say the cloud, most of us think some obscure place in the sky where our data and our websites are being kept. But it's actually in a place just like this, where data will be stored locally, bringing us faster speeds. Exactly. So, for example, if you use YouTube, the, the whole vision is that Google eventually will be able to store some of that data to be localized, you know, with the fast moving data online. Latency matters, you know, gaming matters, you know. But it's not all computers in here. It's also office space with a kick. I'm curious about this room in particular. What is this going to be? So I call it the world's first floating sports court. If you look at it, it's a very unique volume of space. Uh, when you're driving down I-4, you'll notice that it's going to illuminate orange, and there's a 10-foot cantilever all around it that basically gives it the floating effect. The Hostheim headquarters are also one of the taller buildings north of downtown. And it's not just a great view. It's also going to be a tech conference center. So it's basically an indoor-outdoor event space for up to 300 50 people. The whole vision behind that is to have all tech related conferences in the facility. You know, there would be very few opportunities where you can have a conference that's technology oriented effectively in the cloud. And I think that's brings two worlds together, a physical and a virtual world combined. It's a massive project with a worldwide reach, but it's all about supporting Orlando too. You know, we're very, we were born in Orlando. We build facilities abroad, but for us, it was very important to build a flagship facility right here in our home ground. All right, Lou, I learned so much about this story. I didn't know what the cloud was. I mean, you have an idea what yeah. it is, and you see the lines of computers, but then also having a sport court where you can play pickleball and basketball yeah. as just a relief for, from the workday. That floating basketball it's court is really, really cool. It is cool. Yeah, the cool. building's beautiful. Yeah, and then the conference center upstairs. So now, you know, when you drive by this building, you look yeah. at it and say, what is that? Now you know. It's the cloud. You heard it here. Right, simple <laughs> as that. All right,